Hello everyone, I'm Amit from Mail Smartly. It can be tough to keep a track of all the different holidays that are celebrated throughout the year. If you are using Microsoft Outlook as your primary calendar, you are in luck. There is a built-in feature that allow you to add holidays to your Outlook calendar so you can keep track of them all in one place. So here in this video, you will learn step by step method how to add holidays in Outlook calendar. So first go to the file tab, which is available on the top left corner of your screen. Click on options here from the left navigation section, select calendar and from the right section, scroll down to the calendar options here, add holidays to the calendar. So here is an option, add holidays, click on it. When you click on it, add holidays to calendar dialog box appears, which consists of multiple countries. That means select the location whose holidays you would like to copy to your Outlook calendar. Now you have to simply select your country, which holidays you need to copy in your Outlook calendar. So I just simply select United States. You can also select multiple countries such as United Kingdom also. So I just select United States and simply hit OK. So when you receive this message, holidays for United States are already installed. Do you want to install them again? You can simply hit OK. But in my case, I have already added the holidays of United States. So I will take a different example. So I'll show you the different example with United Kingdom. So when I click on United Kingdom, simply hit OK. It will take few seconds and all the holidays added in my calendar. So the pop-up appears, the holidays were added to your calendar. I simply hit OK and simply hit OK once again. Now when I go to the calendar, which is available on the left top corner of your screen, click on it, all the calendars are selected. So I just simply select the calendar of United States for, for show you, showing you, for instance. When I select United States, now, you can see the holidays are already added in my calendar. So there is a holiday on 5th of September, which is Labor Day added in the calendar. If I scroll down, Columbus Day, Halloween Day, and just like that. All the holidays are simply added in my calendar. And this is not only for the current year. If you scroll down and go to the next year also, the holidays also appear in the next year also and so on. That's a very simple method to add holidays of different multiple countries to your Outlook calendar. Apart from that, you can customize your holiday list and add that holiday list to your calendar very easily. First of all, why anybody wants to create their own customized holiday list? When I am working in a multinational company, I have received an email from my HR department which consists of list of holidays. On that day, I realized that if I add that specific list of holidays to my calendar, my calendar intimate me a day before that a holiday is about to come. So I can plan my day according to that reminder. So let's start how, it, how you can create your holiday list. So before starting, first of all, you have to open a notepad. So I just click my notepad and I have already created a customized holiday list. So starting from starting, you have to enter your uh, name of your holiday list. So I have entered your company's US holidays 2017. So I just change it to name your holiday list. Now you can add the nature of holiday and the date. The date must be in the year, month and date format with a comma in the middle of the description and date. You have to follow this exact format. You don't, don't have to keep the spaces. So I just entered one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight holidays. Now the most important part is when you name your holiday, holiday list, you have to enter the figure. If I have created eight holidays, so I have entered eight here. If you have created 
say 15 holiday list or 20 holiday list you have to enter the specific figure here now the next part is when you are ready, uh, okay with the list simply click file tab click on save as and here select the folder so i usually use desktop so i, so I select desktop save as type make it all files now name your file so i just name olive day now the most important part is you have to keep the extension very clear so in that case you have to keep your extension with dot h o l and simply hit save when you save it the file is saved in on your desktop like this so first i close all the notepads if i don't close it it will cause me some error problems so i just simply close it now double click on this uh, icon you can see a small dialog box appears add holidays to calendar so i just select this and simply hit ok now my customized holiday list is already saved on my calendar simply hit ok that way you can easily create your own customized holiday list and simply export or you can create copy those holiday list on your outlook calendar i hope you found this video useful also if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe this youtube channel and also click on the bell icon so you will never miss out any outlook tips and problem solvers video i come up with in future thank you and have a nice day